this is John Libertori from My Media. I'm really excited to introduce to you a new app that we've just developed. And I'm gonna be showing that demonstration of an, an app that we uh, use for scheduling for conference rooms and also for boardrooms. Um, I'm gonna show you the actual hardware today, which is a little 10 inch device that, that can be networked. And it's that app that we're gonna show you how it works. And also we're gonna show you um, the actual hardware today. So um, I have a sample of that. And um, to get right into it, uh, first let's give you a little brief introduction about My Media. We are basically a, a di uh, digital communications company. We help our customers communicate more efficiently and effectively with digital display technology. And um, so this is a kind of very fitting product for what we do. Um, some of our customers here, uh, mostly large enterprise clients, especially when you're at that level, you have multiple locations, you need to communicate, um, and you need a device that's networked that can, can communicate in real time when you're um, out of a larger scale. And, um, and it's great, it's also been uh, fun and fantastic working with these people and uh, learn a lot from them. And, um, and uh, if I was Donald Trump, I'd simply say, uh, the fantastic, the absolutely fantastic, and they're friends of mine, they're, they're great people. But anyway, enough of Donald Trump, let's get right into that, back into the uh, slideshow and presentation. So this is the 10 inch Samsung device that does not require a PC. All the processing uh, gizmos, for lack of a better term, is all inside. And so that could be networked. And so, and the best thing, uh, the best thing about it is no PC is required, but also no actual electrical power outlet. It actually gets its power from the um, RJ45 cable because it's a P over P power over ethernet. Now, uh, you've probably seen here at the, uh, an example we have here for you, uh, an installation um, that our team did at the Conrad Hotel. Um, it's basically, uh, like we've seen this, been around for many years, way, a directional wayfinding. Great, and that's often fantastic. But when you're getting a little bit closer and I want to find, well, where do I need to go? Do I go left or do I go right? And where these can be strategically placed, um, that can help you find your way. So it's either be which hall you're going to, and you start finding your way a lot faster. Um, an idea, here's a little closer look at what it looks like. So if it's that ops meeting that you need to be going to and you can open that door with a greater confidence and knowing that that is where you need to be, fantastic, so you're, you're there. Um, I think that word fantastic from Donald Trump is rubbing off on me. Moving forward, uh, here's an even closer look. Um, where uh, the Four Seasons encased it with other signage, uh, the Plaza A, and when it's not in use, they just basically put their kind of um, logo there, which is um, somewhat stationary. Uh, but it's also an opportunity for them to um, advertise and sponsor other different restaurants that they have, and um, yeah, and just you know let people know what's. Uh, what's offered. So you can see, um, this is an event that we actually programmed and we'll get into the software in a minute. Um, and you see how large it is here. Uh, in the back of it here is just basically the plug-in for RJ45 and also the, um, the power as well. And USB and HDMI external ports. It also has a visa pattern, so uh, mount pattern here. So if you want to just mount it on the back with some sort of um, uh, mount for it. it. It is all here and you can just snap that in and then also either like I said in case it what the Four Seasons did or you could simply um, just basically drywall all, all around it. For example here sponsorship is a great opportunity to um, you know Cisco has sponsored many events that I've been to um, and and what's great about uh, I mean sponsorship I mean sometimes these events are not possible without sponsors but maybe you need multiple sponsors and um, if you're limited in signage, there's just a, it's dynamic, so you can have perhaps a, a couple of sponsors that are maybe sponsoring that event and a great way for them to get their word out. So if we can uh, launch that web app, I'm gonna give you a quick little demo of how it works. So we start with a room. Um, we'll have all the rooms pre-entered and it's just a, a pull down button. You pick that room that you want, the name of the event, and we already just typed that there for you just to save some time. And, um, and of course, a calendar and a time. So you pick the date, and you can do this well in advance. 
um, and uh, you can do that. So we're just making a quick example for you just to give you a demonstration of it and of what time the event ends. And then you choose a file. In this case, we want to add his picture of the speaker or it might be a logo, whatever image that you want. It's a quick upload. <coughs> That's basically it. Um, the limit there of three is if you wanted to post how many events there were, we showed you three events, four events, whatever that might be. You could also do that as well, but more of that uh, another day. So now that I'm happy, I want to hit save and uh, everything is there. But I think I showed you already what it looked like. But it's basically straightforward. It's simple uh, device uh, technology, how to use that. So you can, uh, I think anybody can, you know, use that. And it's not complicated. That's what we wanted to, we wanted to do. So there you have it. You saw basically hardware, software, total integ future integration with uh, Microsoft and also Google Calendar, um, yeah, an easy to use device. So again, feel free to uh, uh, write to us, make your comments, give us a call, happy to, uh, to give you uh, some more information. Once again, my name is John Libertori from My Media. Thanks for watching.